It's been two years in the making, but we are finally off on our dream vacation. So come travel with me. First stop is Chicago. And did I mention that it is 10 hours to our final destination? So we splurged and upgraded to business class. And guys, I have never felt more pampered in my life. We had a five hour layover in Chicago and lived our best life in this flagship lounge. The food was amazing. We were sipping on champagne. Like I could definitely get used to this. Then it was time to board our flight and I had to film like a whole video for my daughter because she's going to die when she sees all the things that you get in business class. And we're off. We left in the evening from Chicago and we'll arrive in our final destination kind of mid morning. Started the flight out with a little cocktail and some snacks. Did I mention it's a couple's trip? Yes, and the boys put me and Cassie together while they took their window seats. And here's Cassie trying to get us kicked out of business class, spilling her cocktail. And here we have dinner, our little starter with some salad and some shrimp. And this was the main meal. The food was pretty good, definitely airplane food, but the service was amazing. And this ice cream sundae was to die for. Now it's time for some shut eye. We're laughing at Hunter as he sits there and watches the flight map the whole time. We're taking some sleep supplements, praying to God that we're going to get some shut eye. And here I am like laying out. I'm done. I mean, these seats turned into a full bed and that was fabulous. But I'm here to tell you, I did not sleep a wink. And look at us. We have arrived in Athens. So we're staying one night in Athens before the rest of our vacation begins. And we're, yeah, we're at the Plaka in this cute little hotel. Look at our little room. Um, check out this view. Also, Athens, Greece is a concrete jungle. Like, yes. And it was so hot. Like, so hot. But check this out. It's the Acropolis. Yes, yeah, right out our door. First stop, tons of coffee. Again, slept zero on the plane. Also heard that grounding was really good for jet lag. So I was like, guys, we've got to find some grass and take our shoes off and ground to hopefully make this jet lag better. But guys, it didn't work. Okay, I'm here to tell you. So spent the afternoon exploring Athens, Greece. There's the Acropolis. We're actually going to hike that tomorrow. It was really cute. Um, loved Athens. There was a nice breeze, but when I tell you it was over 100 degrees, it was so hot. Yes. Set out to explore. Again, I think it's called, like this area is called the Plaka. I'm probably saying that wrong, but tons of little ice cream shops, tons of little stores. Uh, we found this amazing rooftop bar and we're excited to get our first cocktail and first food at Greece. Again, check out these views. Like you can see the Acropolis from everywhere. It's crazy. Started off with these fancy margaritas and then we had our first official Greek salad and our first official Euros, Heroes, I don't know how to say it, but the food was so good. Ran back to the hotel, freshened up, and we are back out to eat again. Because what do you do on vacation but eat and drink? It was so pretty and we could walk everywhere from our hotel, which was a huge plus. Got a great dinner recommendation and grabbed our first tzatziki, our first whip feta. Again, indulging in all the Greek cuisine. I even was like, yo, can I have some cucumbers for this tzatziki and whipped feta? And they were like, absolutely. More Greek salad, more euros. The food was delicious. And this little fan absolutely saved our life. Because again, I'm just going to tell you, it was really hot. And then the entertainment started. <laughs> These guys were so fun. They had the entire restaurant participating. Of course, my table was a bunch of ball humbugs and I'm the only one that got dragged into, I don't know, is this like a conga line? What is this? But it was so fun. We were dancing and singing and doing all the things on our first night in Greece. It was a 10 out of 10. The sunset, oh, 
was absolutely gorgeous. Can you see it um, back there? I mean, we kind of missed it, but it looked amazing. And we wrapped up the night and headed back home, but had to stop for some ice cream. And it was a 10 out of 10. See you tomorrow, guys.